Good morning and welcome to season four of the vlog and check out this brand new intro sequence. So here we are then, season four. Um, it's now 2023. Um, obviously season one was a bit of a mixed match of different years, so I didn't really do like vlog every day. I just want to like, vlog as and when I was doing something. Um, going forward with season four after the big change, um, no, it'll sort of like go back to that, I'll be doing more round where I'm going to be. So that'll be good. Um, but obviously we need to get to um, do the big change. So we need to do a few things here before the big change to be able to happen. Um, so that means putting a few bits on eBay that um, my mum wants me to do because she obviously... Um, got work and everything. I've still got bits to do online that I need to do online for what I need to do. Um, but yeah, mum needs a bit of help putting things on eBay to um, get the big change happening. We're hoping the springtime, so either March, April, May sort of time this year. Um, if not that time, but definitely sometime this year before New Year's, um, the end of this year anyway. So I've got that to look forward to. Then the vlogs, I'll obviously get back. Well, obviously at the minute they're not great. Cause all I really do is sit at this desk and do what I need to do online. But after the big change, um, I'll be more to vlog, more to do. Um, Molly will probably be in the vlogs more. Molly Dog, she's down there at the minute. So um, yeah, things to do, things to get sorted before the big change can happen. Hopefully, it'll be, um, like I said, March, April, May sort of time in the spring. So yeah, anyway, I've got a few things to do online now. And then tomorrow, I'm going to try and get started on what um, we need to do and try and get some bits on eBay. So yeah, a bit of an exciting year ahead, especially once the big change has happened. So yeah. Let's get on with um, this year. I hope it's a good one. Um, so yeah. Anyway, I better get on with a few things I need to do online today. So it's now nine minutes to five. I think I'm gonna head down, do dinner. We've got a choice. Oh, well, we haven't got really got a choice. I'm gonna check the dates. On we've got a hunter's chicken. And we've got steak. I think we've got like a garlic butter that you can put on over the steak and then when you're frying it. So I'm either going to do the steak with chips and peas or I'm going to do the hunter's chicken with chip, with veg. Um, carrots, potatoes, peas. If we do the hunter's chicken. Uh, I'm not going to film that anymore. I think I'm going to try and change it about a bit this season. Um, that's all it wants really last season, wasn't it? But there will be a bit more to this vlog after dinner. I'll let you know what we had in the end. Um, but yeah, I'll see you after dinner. So we've had dinner. It's now 41 minutes past six. I've got the washing up to do. I hate doing the washing up. Mum's left quite a bit on hers, I've got to put that um, either in the bin or Molly could have a little bit of it maybe we yeah, have I mean, a little bit of chicken and whatever um, and then it's EastEnders a bit later but um, like I said earlier we've got to get ready for um, the big change so over here in this cupboard are some of the things that we need to put onto um, eBay. 
DVD like this here. I've got Slumdog Millionaire. Was that American Pie? Rain Man. Love Actually. Mona Lisa Smile. See if you can recognise any of them. Terminal. Vicar Dibley. That's quite good. So yeah. Things that we need to put on to Only Fools and Horses I think we've got most of them Outnumbered Will and Grace um, The Bucket List Great Escape That's not going anywhere, I quite like that film um, But yeah Number one thing, we've got some books And stuff down here Um So oh, yeah, and we've got some other little DVDs I think somewhere. Let me turn the volume down to the TV. There. Molly is down here. You haven't seen her yet this series. Obviously this is like episode one of season four. Molly is just there, and then in here we've got more DVDs in there. I think that's just books. In there. I think it's just books. I still think I think they're going to get put on Amazon in the end. I think, but yeah, Molly's still there, and as you can see, we don't have a Christmas tree. We had these instead what we had for Christmas ball balls in a bottle we had that one there and then over here we had another one and then we had these here little Santas and everything and then we had these down here Santa Claus <coughs> and then we had these little gingerbread things. My mum actually knitted these. I think she knitted Rudolph as well, you know, a little Rudolph thing. But she definitely knitted all the um, gingerbread men. Molly is down here. She's down there now. But yeah, I don't know what else needs to go on eBay. But um, I think these, there's books down here. Books down there. There's things in there. Books here. I think there's more books that I've got upstairs. I don't know about these because these are magazines. So I don't know how that's going to go. Some more books down here and on there. I don't know how interested about putting them on Amazon or something instead of eBay. But the DVDs can go on eBay. So um yeah when I get round to it, I'll probably say in the vlog when I get round to it that they're on eBay. And I might even link in the description on that later video. It won't be this video, it'll be the video once I've got round to um, getting them all set up and everything when they'll be um, on eBay and then I'll, um, I'll put a link, probably I'll put a list of things what's on eBay and then if you like anything you could always um, go on to um, click on the list of that, that link Say you want the Vicar of Dibley DVD, I'll put a link in the description on the later video once it's all set up. I'll put Vicar of Dibley and the link, and then you can click the link to um, eBay if you want to if you want to get that um, that DVD. It's the um, complete collection as well. So. Um, 
Yeah. I think there's some other books through here as well. I think she's got some books and other bits down there that she wants to go on eBay or Amazon or whatever later on as well. So I think with DVDs I don't have to um I don't have to photograph them because I think you can put a link I think you put in the ISBN number or the title and then when you put in the title I think it comes up and then you can pick out of have a look let's say outnumbered I think you can put the eye in. I think there's a number in that barcode. In that, I think you put that number into a section when you put in the um, thing on. And I think they collect the um, a list comes up, and then you can pick the one that you want out of that list. And then instead of having to take a picture of the actual DVD, you've got everything with all the details to that thing as well. But yeah, anyway, I'm now going to get on with the washing up. So my laptop is booting up just there. Um, at the end of season three, when I came to edit that last video of the season, so the last video on this channel, the one before this one, um, I had a bit of problem getting the um, the memory card um, reading in the card reader, and that I end up using this cord and to take this cord put it into the camera, keep the card in the actual camera and then plug the camera in and then get all the clips um, from the last video onto my laptop that way because for some reason, I think it might have been because the laptop was too cold I'll try it with this vlog hopefully it reads it and um, we don't have any problems going forward um, it's not really a problem because I can always plug in, put it back, put the card back into here, into the camera, and then plug that cord in again. Um, but yeah, it did take me a while to figure out that I would have to plug it in. But um, Molly is through here. She's down here now. She's got a house lying on as well, so. That's Hi, I'm going to have a fruity herbal tea with just a little bit of honey in it. So my mum wants a cup of tea, like you've just heard on that um, home health thing, Alexa thing. Um, so I'm going to quickly make her a cup of tea and then I'll be back. And I'm back. Mum's got her tea. Molly's been in the garden. And as I was saying, hoping hopefully my um I'll get the footage off this SD card onto the laptop with no problems. I might have to plug the camera in, like I said, but that shouldn't be a problem. Hopefully it isn't. It took me a while to get it off the card before Christmas. Obviously when I um went to edit the last vlog of last year so hopefully I don't have that problem again I can just get the hopefully it's just plenty of putting the card in seeing if it works if it doesn't put it back into the camera and then revert back to the cable and um, try and get the footage off the card that way um, but hopefully fingers crossed everything will be fine and I'll get the footage off 
either with the cable or through the um, car straight to the laptop. But yeah, anyway, let's go and see Molly again quickly before we end today's vlog. She is here. She's been a little goodie down there. So yeah, I'm going to now watch EastEnders. And then tomorrow night is EastEnders and the first episode of the new Waterloo Road. Um, I've read the description on the um, on the Virgin box when you can go in and see what, like your TV guide. And it says like, okay, it starts in another school and obviously with the title of the program being Waterloo Road. I'm guessing there's like a merger or something in the first episode and um, the name of the school reverts back to Waterloo Road. I've also seen in pictures of um, um, Kim Marsh is a character and I've seen that she's got like, in, like a picture of her in a character um, costume. It's not like a, I'm guessing she's a dinner lady or a cookery teacher or something to that respect and she's got like a penny on and the um, Waterloo Row logo is on that so um, I'm guessing in the first episode it starts off with this new school it was called something else something high and then um, I'm guessing by the end of the episode it'll revert to Waterloo Road and then it'll go off into the um, season when previous into the, like the next over the next few weeks. I'm guessing there'll be about 20 episodes. That's how many there usually are. Hopefully, I'm hoping that there are going to be 20 episodes of Waterloo Road, but we'll see. Anyway, like I said, I'm just going to watch EastEnders and then get on with the editing. So, um, going to end today's vlog here. So, don't forget if you like the vlog, give it a thumbs up subscribe leave a comment and click the bell so you always get notified when i upload new videos and i'll see you tomorrow at 6 pm so don't forget if you dream it believe it achieve it good night